Good morning, everyone. <laughs> the last, today's Wednesday, and I was supposed to dress up. Well, I kind of am. I'm in like sandals, nice shirt, cardigan. I think. I don't know if they're gonna take a picture of me of my whole body or it's just gonna be like stomach up. Mm, I don't know. But like I said yesterday, if you didn't watch that vlog, I'm getting interviewed for the yearbook um, for my new school, which is funny because I got interviewed three times at my old school. Yeah, hey, we don't even get a yearbook. I know. I'll have to ask Kylie to send me photos yeah. of the yearbook. Because there was like three different things. One was like on my clothing line, the other one was on TikTok, and then the other one was like overall social media. No, I think it was funny. But um, this one, it's just one time I think, and it's about social media, like overall. Yeah, it's gonna be like a page of, cause my school has like a lot of, in like social media people that like. So anyways, um, or animated Lexis. I just realized that there's, if you don't count today, Thursday, Friday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, five days. Five days till spring break, I am so excited. But I also have to kind of work my butt off this week and next week because my grades are obviously completely different from other people because they have 20 grades in the grade book. I have two to three or five. So it's a bit harder for me to keep my grade consistent because there's no homework or like no activities to balance out the tests that I've taken but I have all grades except for my history because he still hasn't fixed the zero and then biology because I still have a zero for the quiz thing which I do have to say after school sometime this week because she needs to teach me for like a 30 minute lesson because it's on the EOC and I have to pass the EOC for me to be able to pass biology so I need to do that and then take the quiz because that's what's a zero in the grade book and then. But anyways, I will see you all after school and I'll let you know how my day goes. <laughs> As you can tell, I'm home. We just had a dancing because our Alexas were plugged in, but my mom's vacuuming. Um, but anyways, so I got my history grade up. It's not a B. I will tell you it was at an F. It was 48, but I only had two grades in the grade book. One was a zero and one was a quiz that I got, um, I don't remember what I got on it. I know that I passed it. I just don't remember what, what grade I got, but yeah. <laughs> so I got it up to a B. I just need to get it up to an A. It's because there's only two grades in the grade book. Well, four? Actually, I have no idea, but I just know it's a B, which I'm happy with, but the only grade that I have to get up is biology, but I have to stay after school either tomorrow or Friday and talk, uh, talk to her about it because I have two grades in that grade, in that whatever grade book, and, <laughs> and it's all just tests and quizzes, and I can't just have tests and quizzes. Like, I actually need something else that might thingy so it like balances each other out because I also have a non-passing grade in that because there's a zero and then the other test or quiz that I took which it should be a 80 because I have to tell her to fix it because she gave me partial credit for it um but yeah so school was good today it was okay me and Lexi stopped at Duncan be this okay so this morning I forgot to tell you this morning we went to Duncan we were in the line or whatever and we get there and Lexi goes, where's my wallet? Lexi said, where's my wallet? And I said, I don't know, I don't see it. And we looked in her car for it and she goes, I forgot my wallet. So we had to get out of line. And then I, I didn't tell her that I had money because I didn't want to pay in the morning. Uh -huh. Like I didn't want anything in the morning. So we come out of school and she's like, I really want coffee. And I was like, I'll just pay for it because you drive me. Uh -huh. So that's part of your gas money, I guess. And she was like, okay, you promised? I was like, yeah, so we went and got coffee. Uh, I get a vanilla 
iced latte, I think. She gets like a caramel one that with like extra caramel, whatever. I'm not a big fan of it, but like it's still good. But like it's not something I'm addicted to. I don't think I would ever become addicted to coffee because it just, it, it's like it has a weird zing to it. I don't know. Anyways, I was also asked to go to youth group tonight, which. Wait, what? What? You were what? I was asked to go to youth group tonight. Oh, you were? Yeah. Are you going? I don't know. <laughs> I think it's the same time as it was. I was supposed to go last week, but that's the day, um, well, that was the day, like, right before playlist, before we left or whatever, so, I just, I couldn't, so, I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> um, but yeah, that was how my day went. Uh, nothing really happened. Spectacular. Nothing popular? Is that what you said? Spectacular. Uh, how was your interview? Oh, yeah, I had an interview. So they asked me like 10 questions. They took my photo. I said, I don't even want to see the photo because I know I'm going to have to take it 100 times. So I was like, just do whatever you want with it. They took one photo, so I know it's going to look horrible. And it's a whole body photo. Oh. Yeah. I was like, you're kidding me. But they were really sweet. Um, they just asked me like the basic questions like any person would ask a social media person. They're like, what inspired you? How'd you start? How long? Who do you follow? Who do you get your content ideas from? And like a bunch of other stuff. So I decided I'm gonna go to youth group with a friend, but I think there's some other people going along. So I think it's gonna be a group, but I've never been to youth group, so I'm excited. But look, I got freaking, I brushed my teeth because I drank coffee and my breath smelled really bad. And I was like, this is not gonna happen. So it's like, I don't know. Like it just fell in my pants and I don't even know how it did. Cause like you stand up straight and it's like, like I, I don't know. <laughs> but, and toothpaste, the toothpaste that I have um, stains for some reason. I accidentally got toothpaste on one of my sweatshirts and it's like bleached. Like it is not the same color as the sweatshirt. I was like, okay, but it did that to my jeans. So I just went and got, um, what's it called? Shoot, what is it called? Like stain remover. And I'm gonna try and dry it with my hair dryer because these jeans are not having it with the shirt and this outfit. Like these are more high rise and I think it looks better. So I'm just gonna blow dry my pants and see if it works. I. Yeah, no. I don't. Wait. I don't think it will, and I'm getting ready to leave, so that's great. Love that. For this is so annoying. What the heck? Like, why? Why does this happen to happen to me? Oh my gosh, it's. <laughs> I guess I'm wearing these pants. Whatever, it's fine. I'll just have to constantly pull down my shirt. That's what I had to do with these the other pants, but. I'll just have to like cover it up like this. I'm fine with that. No crossing arms though. That looks like you're standoffish, but like this. Oh Lord. <laughs> that's so annoying. I wanted to wear those pants. And that's what I wore to school today. So now I'm like dirtying two pair of jeans. But this is just what I'm wearing. But um, yeah. Mm. It's a Gucci. <laughs> Okay, so it got I fixed my I changed my wallet. So I usually carry like um like a wrist wallet, but I just didn't want to bring that. $30, my credit card that has a $0 balance. <laughs> I haven't put anything on my card. So when I went to the soccer game, um the first week that I attended school, I Use all my money when we went to Dairy Queen after the soccer game. I had 69 cents and I used it all on a shake that wasn't even that good. <laughs> and I haven't put it on cents. So I think it's been a couple of weeks, two weeks, I think. So I think my car card might be de deactivated. Um, I think there's a rule, like, there's a certain amount of days, like, you can't go with a, no balance on it. So I honestly don't know. But uh, $30, my credit card, and then my permit, which I don't even know why I bring. I just like to have it just to show like, oh yeah, I got an ID. Mm, well, I think it's considered an ID. I don't even know. So I'm getting picked up because my parents are, I think, going to get a golf cart. 
and I might have to tell them like okay so my house isn't on like Google Maps yet like the address it like takes us to a house that's not even built on like the corner but like you have to go left I mean you go straight well you turn left you go straight and then you turn right oh they're here already bye hello we just got home we went out to dinner because they were waiting on me for me to get back from youth group so just to sum it up it was probably it was really fun like i actually enjoyed it i've never went to youth group and i kind of explained earlier that i've been to church before it just hasn't been frequently and i haven't been in a while so I don't know if that's something we'll start as a family. We, like my mom really wants to go to church, but like our schedule is just crazy because you know, yeah, it's a little hard. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't know, like it seems so fun. Like I kind of want to start going like every week, which it probably won't happen because one, I don't drive, which if I did, I probably would start going every other week or maybe every week. It's just so hard because my schedule is like crazy. Plus you have homework and then I also have to film and filming videos for my channel is like usually today or like tomorrow. I mean I'm sure I can work it out like if I really want to start going like I need to stop procrastinating everything like I just gotta get everything together and then I think it would be fine. So yeah I definitely it's something that I kind of want to get into like just going because Everyone there seems so nice, like it's a mix of middle schoolers and high schoolers. And I met a couple girls, they're super sweet, they are in my grade. And they're kind of friends with like someone that I know in a friend group, so I was like, oh my gosh, that's so cool. And uh, the speaker, or I don't know what you call them, I think it's a speaker, I'm new to this, I'm sorry. He was super nice, like he's, like he's just so outgoing, like I was like, I wish I was out, that outgoing. But like he's super funny, honestly, and he actually knew of me prior to coming so i don't know if the person that i went with told him or someone told him i i honestly don't know how that happens but it's okay um but he was like yeah that's so cool and i'm like so like he actually does it as well and i was like oh my god onesies and they also told me that there's like um like a camping trip they go on to tennessee over summer break and i've always wanted to go on a camp so, I don't know, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. They, the girls that I was talking to, um, they said it's probably like, the best time of their life. And it's like so much fun. And like I have friends like from cheer and stuff, like from Top Dog, that also go to camps like that. And like overall just like go to a camp. And it's probably the most fun they have ever. And like it's the best experience. And I've heard you just make really good friends. And I honestly feel like it would be good for me. Like a week where I think you go a week without your phone and like you just relax. I just finished my PowerPoint for the second time. My mom deleted my first one, which was okay because it's literally just like pictures of brownies and like food. So it's okay. So I just had to redo it because I forgot the title of my last PowerPoint. So I just resubmitted it like sent it to her. I haven't even presented yet. But I was just checking my grades. And I have all A's, a B, and then a non-passing grade. Which is biology. Which the thing is I only have, which I only have two grades in the grade book. One's a zero and then one's a, oh wait, actually three, a hundred zero and then the other one. Okay, anyways, hopefully you all enjoyed today's video. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I will see you all lovely people tomorrow back with another video.